Hi everyone, it's Schematic Med, and today we are going to talk about carpal bones. The eight short carpal bones of the wrist are organized into two rows. A proximal row which articulates with the bones of the forearm, the ulna medially and the radius on the lateral side, and a distal row which articulates with the basis of the five metacarpal bones of the hand. The carpal bones allow the wrist to move and rotate vertically. It is important to remind ourselves that in the anatomical position, the palm of the hand is facing forwards or anteriorly, with the thumb pointing outwards or laterally. As we already mentioned, carpal bones are organized into two rows, proximal and distal. We will start from the lateral side to medial side. Well, in proximal row we have scaphoid bone, lunate bone, triquitrium bone, pisiform bone. In distal row, again lateral to medial, we have trapezium bone, trapezoid bone, capitate bone, and hamate bone. 